Add that to the kill count. On this special episode of Obligatory Infotainment, today we are looking at a plushie. Again. But this time it's one of Bon the Rabbit. Yes, the Bon the Rabbit. A character from the hit new series, well, it's not entirely new, uh, called The Walton Files. Uh, originated in 2020, uh, slash 2019, it was based off of uh, Five Nights at Freddy's, it was supposed to be a fan game, but, um, called Welcome to Bond's Burgers, but then that got turned into the Walton Files Analog Horror Series. So, uh, here we are now. This plushie is from Makeship. They are a pretty good company, I will say. Yeah, there's a tag right there. Uh, not sponsored by Makeship at all. I'm pretty sure you might get the gist by now that I'm not sponsored in any, any way by these fantastic companies. But they do make these very good, very high-quality plushies, I will say. And they, um, they're very, they're very thick in a very good way in terms of, like, the material, uh, used for them. Um, so this was my first time... Um, I'll talk more about the specific plushie in a minute, but this is my first... <coughs> <coughs> I just want to highlight that this is my first time ever purchasing from Makeship ever. And, um, I'm not going to say how long this took to ship, because, uh, uh, it was, a, it was a minute. The process of paying for this thing was actually pretty simple, I will say. Um, although... The price on this plushie, and, like, the the thing is with Makeship, is that this is not gonna fire shots at them or anything, they're a great company and all. Um, if you can handle the price, uh, the prices for plushies like these, I'd say, I'd say give it a go, and if you're, like, a big fan of the Walton Files specifically, I'd say go for it if you're willing, uh, to pay a pretty penny. I really like the, uh, touch of the blood stains added right here, as well as the, uh, the funny eyes, the funny analog horror eyes that um, tend to be overused. But these, these I think, are just a little bit more unique, I, I guess. I don't want to make too many people triggered who are way too steep into the downsides of analog horror, like using, you know, specific tropes. But the, the thing about the Walton Files, right... Uh, is that they're starting to, it, to me, it seems like they're starting to break away from typical analog horror tropes and going for more cinematic, uh, angles and shots and all that. Um, again, not spoiling The Walton Files 4. Watch it! A couple blood stains here, right there. There's people walking upstairs. I don't know where these, uh, like, dirt stains came from. I, I don't think that's... Or, or maybe it was just always there when I purchased a plushie. Whatever, I'm not getting a replacement. At first, I thought this was just, like, splotches of oil, but no, it's supposed to be, um, openings, I guess. It's it's supposed to be holes in the animatronic himself, because in the Walton Files, Bon, very, very, very old, beat-up, 50-year-old animatronic at this point. Um, but yeah, I really like the touches on these, especially the... The cute little bow tie. The cute little bow tie. <laughs> it's so cute. I'm gonna rip it out. There's really nothing on the back, nothing on his asshole. One more thing about this plushie that I really like is this feature. Um, it came with this severed arm, which I which I do think is hysterical. Uh, this is supposed to be the arm of a character, uh, a character who dies in the Walton Files, not sp spoiling who. Um, he goes by the name of Brian Smells, or Stells, and you can attach his arm like so, so he can feast on his hand. It looks like he's brushing his teeth with this thing. Vaughn can also use this hand for a lot of different things, like maybe as a dildo. He can help out his willy, and he can also brush his teeth. And just for shits and giggles, here's a comparison. A big noticeable difference is the no cotton tail present on uh, Bonnie. Bonnie meant. But yeah, pretty much that was me talking about uh, Bon the Rabbit. 
uh, plushie as well as showing a small comparison between him and uh, Bonnie right here. I got a low power notice. And uh, let's get Bon over here and uh, end the end the video. Where? Um. Uh, Bon, what? Um. Uh, Bonnie, where's Bon? What'd you do with Bon? Where? Where the, where the hell is he? Where's Bon? Where's Bon the rabbit? Where the? I give, you, I, give you, I give you one chance. I give you one chance, Bonnie. I give you one chance. I put you next to Bon, and this is what happened. He disappeared on me, Bonnie. Where is he? Where's Bon? Where's Bon the rat?